What is up guys and welcome to the game plus today I have another video for you guys another tutorial This time is how to turn off two-step verification on the PlayStation I'm making this video uh, because of a request that I have from one of my viewers So without further ado, let me show you how to turn off this feature Okay, in order to turn off the feature now, you need to go to settings Then you go where it says account management, account information, then you're going to go to the last option, two-step verification. After you reach two-step verification, you're going to see the first option which says status. It says active. That means that right now you're using this two-step verification. From there, you can actually turn it off. Also, if you still have access to this area where the backup code is, you could actually get some codes here and try to log into your PlayStation. You cannot receive those codes on your phone. That would be your backup there. And in your mobile phone, you could see the numbers that you had set up on the PlayStation in order for you to receive the backup code for the two-step verification. Now, going back to status, we're going to go to click inactive to deactivate the two-step verification on the PlayStation. Just click confirm and then just wait. And two-step verification is already disabled on your PlayStation. That's how you turn off to save notification on PlayStation. And by by going on phone, uh, mobile phones, you can see the number that was that you were using there. And from here, you can actually remove that number. If you're no longer using that phone number or you lost the number, you can remove it from here. And from the same option, you could add a new phone number to use. We use two-step verification from this option. Right here, you could add an, a new phone number. Is you not, is you lost the other number you were using, or you changed the number you forgot about it? But if you have the, if you if you have access to the backup code, that would be like the only way for you to go back, remove it, and log in. As I show you how to turn it off, now I'm going to turn back on my two-step verification on the PlayStation by going to the same settings again. We're gonna set it up. I don't have to put my number again because it's already there, it's already saved on my account. So after you set it up again, you're going I'm going to receive a code. I'm gonna enter that code and I will be able to log in again on my PlayStation and set up the stoop step verification one more time. All the code that you receive here is gonna be randomly generated, so none of this code is gonna work for you. They're ran randomly generated for me. After you turn two step verification again always leave the second option always with a check mark because it will sign you out out of all of your accounts in order to to perform the new the news uh, changes that you did in your account so always leave the check mark but remember you will have to sign it again and you're gonna receive a call in order for you to log into those devices again I recommend you to leave it all because it will basically sign you out out of all your accounts and put the extra layer of security with two-step verification that you already set up if you don't know how to set it up um i have a you can go and watch my previous video which will tell you with more detail how to set it up step by step because some of the steps here are a little bit um being skipped because of all the information is already saved on my places you account. and i'm just showing you just in case you want to change the number or use the same number again how to turn it on and how to get there so thank you guys for watching i hope you find this video informative and helpful remember to like favorite comment and subscribe for more and if you have any question don't hesitate to put it down in the comments below i will be sure to answer your questions as soon as possible once again thank you for watching i will see you on the next video bye